So yeah, my bags. So I'm not talking about suitcases or bags which you can carry. I'm actually talking about bacteria. So I'm going to start with a very personal question. Whoever suffered from diarrhea when traveling abroad? So in fact, um, there are 80 million travelers each year that are affected by traveler's diarrhea, so-called TD. And uh, what we asked ourselves is, why are only travelers affected and not the locals who live in the countries? And the reason behind this is that their gut has not adapted to the foodborne bacteria it is facing. So to look at the numbers again, it's 55% of all people traveling to developing countries. Um, the highest risk regions are Asia, Africa, the Middle East, and Latin America. The main source for the pathogens are food and water, which you take in daily. And the main pathogen in traveler's diarrhea are bacteria. And what is very interesting is that those vary a lot between geographic regions. So what is there on the market right now? You got opioids like Imodium, probably everybody knows it. It's not a very good treatment because it only causes constipation and the pathogens actually stay in your gut. Then you got uh, antibiotics, also not a very good treatment because you got a problem uh, with the resistances, then it shouldn't be taken without medical supervision, and you got many side effects. So what are we doing? We're doing symbiotics. Um, there are no recorded side effects. They actually repopulate the healthy microbiome. They act preventively, and it's a causal instead of a symptomatic treatment. So what is a symbiotic? The symbiotic is essentially the combination of a probiotic, which are living bacteria cultures, which are good for your gut, and a prebiotic, which in our case is inulin, that help the living bacteria cultures to grow in your gut. So what are we doing? As I said, the pathogens vary a lot between geographic regions. So we develop pathogenic profiles of different travel regions, and then we tailor the good gut bacteria, the probiotics, specifically to the pathogenic profiles of different travel regions. So you got a geographically specific medication, you got no side effects, and we all combined this in a very intuitive packaging. Uh, it's a five-day treatment with two capsules a day, and you start on your first day of traveling. And of course, we not only have, having it for uh, Latin America, but we also have it for um, Africa, the Middle East, for Europe and North America, and for Asia. So yeah, um, we started with a travel product in February 19, but we're gonna launch some other product in the microbiome field. So the next product is gonna be focused on dietary changes. So for instance, if somebody turns gluten-free or lactose-free, they experience huge changes in their microbiome, and you can assist them with good bacteria again. Then we're gonna introduce a product which is more focused on daily well-being. Then we're gonna introduce a product which is uh, focused on people who quit smoking because people who quit smoking experience constipation or diarrhea and you can assist them with good bacteria. And then in the end, we're gonna introduce a product uh, which is focused on antibiotics because people who take antibiotics, they often experience that their good bacteria is killed by the antibiotics and you can repopulate their microbiome again. So yeah, um, looking at the team, I founded the company with Sebastian Wall. He's the scientist behind all of this. Uh, he studied at ETH Zurich, worked in strategy consulting and at a venture capital life science fund. I for myself studied business at EBS and ECP, worked in investment banking and private equity. So what is our status quo? Uh, we founded the company in August uh, 2018. We launched the Ford Travelbacks product in February 19. Uh, we got two offices, one in Zug, one in Munich. We got six team members so far that are hired full-time in the fields of pharma and business. We managed to close some sales partnerships, so we are selling through Amazon Prime and in selected German pharmacies at the moment. We're going to roll out in 500 Swiss pharmacies in August. Then looking at funding and financials, we received 240K in funding from Angels. Our current monthly run rate is 10K, so that's three months post-launch. And we sold more than 1,000 Travelbacks products in three months. Looking at the market for probiotics, um, both globally and in Europe, billion dollar markets uh, with a steady CAGRs of 7 to 9%. So, thank you.